going on my dudes this is Dustin Selzer from electrician to you and today I'm gonna to take apart a plug and a switch and show everyone what is inside of a plug and a switch a lot of apprentices out there have mentioned just out of curiosity how does a switch work what does it look like what does it look like on the inside and I say open the shit up just grab a fucking switch and grab a plug and pull it apart but for some of y'all that are lazier I will do this for you all right first thing I'm just going to take a standard plug and start ripping the damn thing apart. There's not a lot of good leverage points to being able to take the face off of this, but let's see if I can move the camera a little bit. Get out of here, wire. Get out of here, monkey. Okay. So I try to do this kind of carefully so we can actually see what the insides look like. So you can see, I mean, these face holes line up pretty much perfectly. This is your ground, and then this is going to be your neutral, you know, your, your silver side. Silver is always neutral. Gold is always hot. So your, whatever you're plugging into this device literally just plugs into those little slots. Um, this hole here matches up with the hole in the middle. That's just for putting your uh, plate over. But that's pretty much it, man. Um, this little piece of metal basically connects this terminal to this terminal. So both of your neutrals are always connected and both of your hots are connected too. There are some instances where you may want only one side of this plug to, uh, you like want this one to be on one circuit, this to be on another, or you want this to be a constant hot and you want this one to work with a switch. And the only way to do that is to take this tab and cut it. And that basically breaks the continuity between the top terminal and the bottom terminal. And in most situations, you're just gonna leave the, uh, leave the neutral as it is because you're just sharing a neutral. But that would allow you to uh, have one circuit up here or have this switched and that constant hot. That's pretty easy, man. There's not much more to it. Each one of these things comes out if you try hard enough, as you just saw. But that's the inside of a switch. Ah. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this Decora uh, switch apart. Hopefully this one's a little bit easier. Get out of here. Go. Okay. So the plastic is going to come off the yoke. And I want to very carefully do this so nothing falls out of it. But here you have this little flapper, this plastic flapper, that uh, is touching this piece of metal. This piece of metal, as you can see, moves, goes up and down. So when you push it one way, let me see if I can get a better angle. I really need to take the yoke off completely. Let me see if I can do that without all this shit exploding. I'm just going to cut it. There we go. That kept everything intact. So if you can see all the way down inside of there, it looks like there's a little button down there with a, with a flap of metal on it. And basically this thing sits and makes... I don't know why I'm doing it on the side of the screen. This sits and makes contact. So the switch is open or off, and when it touches that metal, the switch is on. That's pretty much it. The actual mechanics of the switch in this Decora one um, is in this little flapper. So if you notice when you push up or push down, that flapper moves, and it just engages or disengages this little piece of metal, and it turns the switch on and off. That's it. So that is literally it. That's the inside of a switch and the inside of a plug. Um, I'm probably gonna do a few more of these videos for three-way switches, four-way switches. Um, probably going to talk about how three-way switches and four-way switches work. And what we call in Texas, a California three-way. Or what some people call an illegal three-way. Um, talk about some switch loops and some, uh, some weird kind of crazy wiring in a little bit. But uh, let me know if you guys have any other video ideas. I'm all ears. And uh, thank you for watching. Um, check out the Facebook page, Electrician U. Join that shit. And 
get at me, man. Love hearing from y'all. Uh, talk to you soon. Bye.